Hello everyone, you're welcome to Jam Vibes. Right now, something is actually going completely out of hand as Chigumba, Chabango, judges are all targeted already in the new US sanctions list which has caused a great stir on the socials, especially all over Zimbabwe. Before I give you all some insider details about what is ongoing, kindly do well to follow Jam Vibes please. Like this video, drop a comment and above all, share this video with all of your friends and loved ones. In a press statement released yesterday, the US Secretary of State Antony Blinken declared a new visa restriction policy aimed at individuals believed to be undermining democracy in Zimbabwe. The policy outlined under Section 212A3C of the Immigration and Nationality Act targets those responsible for acts such as electoral manipulation, voter disenfranchisement, and intimidation of voters. Secretary Blinken emphasized that the visa restrictions would apply to individuals engaging in a range of activities detrimental to democracy in Zimbabwe. These include manipulating or rigging elections, excluding political opposition members, restricting the operations of civil society organizations, that is the CSOs, and engaging in corrupt practices that undermine the electoral process. The restrictions may also extend to those who interfere with the independent operation of the judiciary during electoral cases or abuse human rights in Zimbabwe. The U.S. visa restriction policy is not directed at the Zimbabwean people, but specifically targets individuals involved in activities detrimental to democratic principles. The United States aims to support Zimbabweans in their pursuit of free and fair elections that genuinely reflect the will of the people, strengthen democracy, uphold the rule of law, and protect human rights by extension. Commenting on this development, political analyst Nicola Strube speculated that the move by Secretary Blinken might be targeting specific individuals within Zimbabwe. Strube pointed to accusations against key figures, including people like Justice Priscilla Chigumba, the head of the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission, who has been accused of conducting fraudulent elections some time ago. More to this, Sengenzo Chibangu, the Interim Secretary General of Citizens Coalition for Change, allegedly is accused of obstructing other CCC members from contesting in by-elections. Kube also mentioned judges accused of siding with ZANU-PF in court cases involving the CCC. The political analyst suggests that these individuals could be the primary focus of the U.S. visa restrictions, signaling a more targeted approach to address concerns about democratic processes in Zimbabwe. Without necessarily judging, I want each and every one of you to tell me in the comment section what you think. Based on everything being said and alerted in today's video, I love you all so dearly. Do well to come back here for more updated gist and vibes. Do not leave this place without sharing this video to the end of the world and see you all in our subsequent uploads.